One of the biggest issues in public international law today is how we regulate the new kinds of armed conflict that we're seeing. Conflicts not between states, but involving non-state armed groups like ISIS, Boko Haram and Al-Qaeda. This has been the focus of my research and recently I've published a book on the topic of detention in non-international armed conflicts. And one of the main findings I've made is that these kinds of detention operations involving non-state armed groups are regulated in full by the law of armed conflict and human rights law. This is an important finding because it helps to ensure that detentions by states and non-state groups are regulated in full by international law and don't fall into the kinds of legal black holes that we saw with Guantanamo Bay, for example. It's also a very topical issue and one with which UK courts have been dealing a great deal in recent years. The UK Supreme Court recently handed down a judgment on British detention operations in Afghanistan, and I'm pleased to say they relied on my book uh, in their findings.